Good morning lovely people and welcome to Joy Energy Tarot. I'm Jenny. Today I'm doing something a little bit different. It is pick a picture and uh, we'll do an intuitive reading. I've asked for guidance for these cards. If you like this please push like and subscribe and you'll receive other further free readings. Remember to um, push the notification bell. I also do private readings as well. Joyenergytarot at gmail.com Okay, let's move on. So the first one is Cosmic Breath, if you like this. Number one, um, with an amethyst next to, next to it. Cosmic Breath. The middle pile is woman coming out of the dark and finding love, or seeing love. This is the middle pile. The last pile is celestial beings. So these are actually guided um, paintings that I've done. And now we've got the guided messages. So have a think about which pile resonates with you and which one you would like and I will now start. So number one and the time is ooh, 1 11 or 1 12. Okay, you have got hiding. The cat card hiding. Just trying to get that there you go. Stay pot. Do not reveal personal intentions. The sacred is encouraged as you keep special things for yourself alone. Keep ideas close to the heart. Your plans and aspirations should be protected. Be clever in your plan. Do not show your hand of, of cards. Do not allow others to hurt you. Hold your own space to keep your vulnerabilities safe. This assures you and your desire are safe and sound. Now is not the time for grand action, but for quiet plotting and planning. Magic grows in containment. Place energy and precise focus on the heart of the matter to help it keep strong, grow strong. The time will come to share, but not yet. The time will come to act, but not now. Keep quiet like a cat. Slink into the background. Felines will bask in shadows until the coast is clear. Cats create personal space by disappearing when they need to. Where do you find refuge? How and where can you escape to, to evade prying eyes and unwanted and evasive attention? You decide when and where to service and not a moment before. You are in control of your, your interactions, energy exchange and boundaries. Time alone is spent well. Rejuvenate yourself in silence. Your silence will never judge you. Okay. The next one was Angel of Healing. So this is the Cosmic Breath Pile number one, Angel of Healing. The angels have felt your sadness and have shown up today to send you healing. Your angel of healing has felt your sadness has shown up in the reading today to reflect healing light into your heart. Your angel wishes you to know that you are loved more than you can possibly imagine. Even though you feel alone and unloved at times, know that you are eternally loved. Whether you feel it or not, you are dearly loved and appreciated by many on the earth plane as well as in the angelic realm. Close your eyes right now. Place your hand upon your heart and feel the healing light pour through as you feel the presence of your angel. Feel yourself being breathed and supported by the universal life force of love and imagine yourself glowing with light. Talk to your angel, ask anything you wish, share anything you wish. You may communicate through writing or simply through thoughts and feelings. Doubt not that your angel exists. You will receive a positive sign or confirmation of some kind in the next few days, which will help you to both trust and believe. That's lovely, isn't it? And now our lovely cat cards. Mystery. Mystery. Hope you can see that okay. For many hundreds of years, scientists and scholars have been trying to work out how our world works, and yet the world remains full of mystery. Instead of trying to figure everything out logically, accept that some things will always remain a mystery. And now a lovely little guiding message for you. Go with the flow and let things happen. That beautiful art by Josephine Wall. Go with the flow and let things happen. 
Okay, have a lovely day. Blessings to you. Right, let's start on the woman who has found love coming out of the dark into the light. It can be a man as well, of course. Okay, watching. So your message is, you've actually got two. Um, so they're saying in the summer, the wild energy of midday, use the summer energy of midday. But at the moment you're watching. Okay, these are cat mystery, cat to oracle cards. Just observe, more information is needed. The situation is unfolding. Allow for time to let things develop. Employ feline alertness to watch and wait for the right moment. Is the ultimate goal worth your effort and focus? Is something bigger and better in store? Widen your view, open the aperture and allow the unfolding to provide every th option. What questions still need to be asked? What information is still required? Do some detective work on your own. Ask allies to gather information for you. This allows you to make your next move with grace and effectiveness. Do not let personal hunger, cravings <coughs> excuse me, and greed move you before the moment is ripe. Rewards are reaped for those with patience. Stay still and observe. Gifts are bestowed on those with perseverance. Cats are the active observers of any situation they're interested in. Become the active observer by allowing full embodiment of the moment. Emotions should slip away. Do not think or calculate, simply observe. Put desires on the back burner to become a neutral tracker. Then the big picture comes into focus and all relevant details will be whoops, sorry, will be revealed. Okay, in summer. Um, the wild energy of midday. So enjoy the moment, live fully, and give value to what you have. Enjoy the energy for you. You will enjoy more of the energy of focusing at midday. This is when your desire is fired up as the air shimmers with sunlight and sparkles of noon echo the rich sounds of summer and glamour of midday. Vulnerability and openness unfurl. Expansion and manifestation appear in all things. Delight, laughter and romance take centre stage. Sensuality and sexuality hit their peak. Fun replaces work. Effortless ease, is sorry, effortless ease empowers the issue at hand. Release the struggle. Allow light to expand your intent at a perfect pace. Make your desire known and release it. Trust the day's magic as sunlight falls through leaves like drops of dew. Play and let pleasurable actions bring joy to the body and soul. Trust the beauty within. Light yourself up from the inside. Wow, that's gorgeous. And then the next card you got was Angel of Abundance. Wow, lucky you. What a nice little pile to receive. Okay, so those of you who chose... Um, the second pile, you now have Angel of Abundance. The Angel of Abundance has shown up in your reading today to, be to bestow a special blessing upon you. Accept this blessing of light and allow it to flow through your heart and mind. Allow it to both illuminate and inspire you. A steady flow of abundance is about to manifest in your life because of your willingness to willingness in recent months to give and receive in equal measure. True abundance manifests when we love and value ourselves as much as we love and value those who are dear to us. Keep an open heart and mind and continue to give and receive freely. Accept all the abundance the universe is offering you and the clear knowledge that you deserve it. Remember that. Now our little lovely little cat cards. Proceed with care. So if you're focusing on something, they're telling you, just proceed with care. You're moving in the right direction, but be aware that you need to proceed with care. Consider each step carefully and avoid making impulsive decisions. Okay? And last, vacation. Take time for relaxation and adventure. So those are your guiding messages for number two. Okay. Okay. Pile number three, the celestial beings. This is your guiding messages for the day or the week. Attitude, okay. So, your attitude. 
let's have a look at that. Um, I've just got to find it, sorry. Attitude, here we go. So if you chose Celestial Beings, here's your guiding card, uh, 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 sorry, guiding cat oracle message. You're desiring intimacy. You need to think about it gently and quietly. Advice, gather that which you love close to you. Whisper to the stars of the firmament. Invoke and align with cyclical nature of the moon. Lunar cycles support natural growth. Contact and seek those who feed your soul. Who knows you? Who understands you? Find the company of like minds. Seek connections on the intuitive and emotional level. Speak truth and honesty. Allow vulnerability to fill the space of the situation at hand. Brush up against your desire with grace to foster connection. Honesty is rewarded. Let objects of affection know they are appreciated. Speak intentions aloud. Empower yourself while shining on light on others. Reflect the beauty of others like a mirror. Cats are subtle in their messages of intimacy. A simple brush up against you, half-closed eyes, or the light touch as they curl by your feet reflects feline intimacy. Humans should remember that simple and small gestures go a long way. They have a profound effect. Never forget how powerful you are and that even a look, smile or single phrase can mean the world to another. Offer gestures of kindness to yourself as well. Okay? Now, God of Indulgence. God of Indulgence. Sorry, I'm a bit slow here. Healing image. Oh, looking in the wrong place, of course. Oh, dear me. Sorry about this. Sorry about the delay here. Right. Getting closer. Here we go. <laughs> Finally, but look at him. Worth the wait. God of indulgence. It's all right. Stop beating yourself up. It's wonderful to indulge in things we love every once in a while. Everything is fine in good measure. Just don't overdo it. Whether it's food, drink or substances of any kind, relationships or material possessions, remember, excess of anything leads to some form of imbalance. Yet at the same time, remember that all is valid and all is love. Little indulgence in some form or another is natural and even healthy. So don't beat yourself up when you do indulge in those things you love. Just be mindful. Don't deny yourself. Just keep it in balance. And when you do indulge, try to do it in ways that nurture and nourish your spirit rather than cloud or suppress it. Okay. Now the cat messages, cat guidance. Um... <clears throat> This card seems to come up quite a bit when I do um, I do live cat wisdom readings on Facebook, and this people often pick this one, or it's guided to to them. Life's journey is full of strange new encounters. It's normal to feel a little bewildered by an unexpected outcome or discovery. Know that you are always equipped to deal with whatever happens. So relax and try to take life as it comes. Okay, and your last message is legends. Learn from those who inspire you. So that was very interesting with the celestial beings. That is sort of um, finding people who are like-minded. Well, blessings to you all, and I hope you've enjoyed this uh, new style of reading and have chosen the pack that uh, vibrates well with you. So blessings to you all. All the best. Love and light. Bye.